Using the Commvault Command Center, you can quickly recover full virtual machines, virtual machine files, or files within a virtual machine, all from an easy-to-use interface. In this quick demonstration, we'll show you how to perform a full virtual machine recovery. From the Commvault Command Center, choose Solutions, then Virtualization. Here you are presented with a list of the configured hypervisors. In this example, we're going to recover a VMware virtual machine. Click on the Actions button next to VMware vCenter and select Restore. You will then see all of your recovery options, including the ability to recover guest files, virtual machine files, and VMDKs, which you can attach to an existing virtual machine or perform a full virtual machine recovery. We will be selecting the full virtual machine option. From the next screen, you will see a list of the virtual machines available for recovery. Simply select the appropriate virtual machine or machines and click on Restore. You have some restore options, such as whether this is an in-place restore or what access node will perform the recovery. We will be using the Media Agent access node and performing an out-of-place restore. Because this is an out-of-place restore, we will need to choose the name for the to-be-restored virtual machine. After inputting the name, we'll then select Next. The following screen has some additional restore options, but we're going to leave the default settings and submit the restore job. Once the restore is submitted, you can quickly view the progress by clicking on View Jobs. You can also see any events that are associated with the job in the Events section. Here's one now. It looks like the job completed successfully and our virtual machine is recovered. And that's it! The Commvault Command Center lets you easily recover your virtual machines in just a few simple steps. Thanks for watching.